The Indiana State House lawmakers passed a resolution today sending a firm message that they oppose and condemn assisted suicide. Emily Longnecker is here to explain the push behind the resolution. Emily. Yeah, the resolution was written by Republican Senator Tyler Johnson, who's also an emergency room physician, and it comes as several states around the country are considering what some call death with dignity laws. Today, the Indiana Senate passed a resolution along party lines condemning assisted suicide. Under current Indiana law, assisted suicide is already banned in Indiana, whether by a doctor or anyone who would help someone take their own life. That's not the case in some states like Oregon that allows terminally ill people to end their lives through the voluntary self-administration of lethal medications. According to Death with Dignity that supports end-of-life advocacy and policy reform, more than 10 states are considering Death with Dignity acts this legislative session. Monday, the Indiana Senate passed a resolution saying Indiana will not be one of them, but not before some debate. For us in this body to make a decision concerning assisted suicide for everybody else in, in this world, starting with the state of Indiana, who are us? I am not God, and I, intend, and I don't intend to play God. Physician-assisted suicide is contrary to a physician's duty as a healer and undermines the physician-patient relationship. It is not difficult to stand here today and draw a line in the sand. Please stand with me and condemn physician-assisted suicide. Democratic Senator Shelley Yoder argued that the General Assembly should hold public hearings to hear what Hoosiers think about this issue. This topic also came up in a House bill that would have allowed terminally ill patients to end their own lives. That bill never got a committee hearing. At the Indiana State House, Emily Longnecker, 13 News.